This is Gangajan, the largest national park in Thailand. Running along the border with Myanmar, this spectacular park is home to some of the most picturesque rainforest scenery in the country, and is also a great place to view some of Thailand's vast array of wildlife, a good portion of which is located right within this very park. The park is a bird watcher's paradise, as it is home to hundreds of species of birds, including the impressive Great Hornbill. If you are extremely lucky, you may also get to see Asian elephants, gowers, and even the elusive leopard and Indochinese tiger. Even though seeing some of these rare animals remains quite an unlikely possibility, the thrill of knowing that you could see one is something we absolutely love and why Gangajan National Park is a place we will continue to visit well into the future. Heading to Gangajan National Park, we left Bangkok bright and early and drove down towards Pechaburi. After only a few short hours on the road, we arrived at the park ready for a day of exploring and hopefully spotting some incredible wildlife along the way. The road leads straight through the park with the jungle surrounding you on all sides. We pulled over just to enjoy the fresh air and listen to the sounds of nature, which is something we don't get very often living in Bangkok. When you visit any wild place, it's always great to stop and pay close attention to the smaller creatures that might be crawling around. We found this extremely colorful spiny orb weaver spider, which I was lucky enough to film eating its breakfast. We also found a massive colony of spiders. Yeah, if you're not one for uh, spiders, I don't think you want to come in here. Once we drove deeper into the park, we found a clearing that was marked with a bird watching sign. So we parked the car and waited for the birds to come to us. The first large bird we spotted was the incredible Crested Serpent Eagle, which is a medium sized bird of prey with a wingspan of up to 176 centimeters. It can be found in forested areas in South and Southeast Asia. We patiently waited till it swooped down from the tree. Sadly, it flew off into the forest and we were unable to get a closer look. We also had the privilege of being visited by a small flock of oriental pied hornbills. 
These birds have an exceptionally beautiful coloring and are quite common in the Gangajan area. These ones seem particularly interested in whatever was in the far away treetops, so this was as close as we got. Then we got extremely lucky. A male great hornbill came swooping in right over our heads. He definitely took us by surprise. Interestingly, their wings are so big that they sound like a jet when they fly through the air. This was definitely turning out to be the highlight of the day. The great hornbill is quite possibly my favorite bird in Thailand. They are just simply gorgeous creatures. However, they can also be quite difficult to spot, as they prefer staying high up in the trees foraging for fruits, insects, and small animals. This particular one was a male, as we could tell with his distinctive red eyes, which the females don't have. We spent quite a bit of time watching him as he flew from tree to tree, eating some sort of fruit and tearing into the bark, looking for insects. He must have passed overhead at least three times. The park was relatively quiet, so we had an audience with him all to ourselves. Before heading to our lodge for the night to rest up and get something for dinner, we spent our last hour watching a few of the smaller birds fly around. Needless to say, our first day in Gangajan proved to be an epic one. 